Hi everybody again. So now that we've done our beautiful sky, you can see how that looks. So everything's completely dry. That's the most important thing. I have waited perhaps a little bit too long. So what I'm looking at now is um, just simply um, um, going to just do a little bit of a wash. Um, let me just get myself ready here. And I'm going to do a little bit of a wash here. Uh, can you see that? Okay. Um, there we go. I don't know if that's good. Let me just move that over um, this way. There we go. Um, in actual fact, bear with me. I'm going to just clip myself a bit over there because I want to maximize everything you say, see. And at the same time, you see, you're going to be able to see, well, here's part of my palette. Um, which is really important because you want to know everything I'm doing, which is part of being uh, a true artist. So these clips are amazing. Um, this is a uh, board that I had someone do for me. This uh, kind of like an easel, table easel. Very affordable. Don't need to spend a lot of money. Don't be fooled. Definitely you want to spend money for good quality paints and good quality uh, brushes. That's that's important too. Just secure your painting down. So here we go. Um, here we go. So um, that being said, now we're looking at, um, we've got our sky. We have a little bit of gray happening in here. I should bring some gray down here, but we're working in another um, part of this painting right now. So. What I think I really want to do is I want to just bring in some of that rose, rose color. Can you see that? Not really. There you go. Well, I'll figure this out. I'm getting, I'm new at this. I uh, have classes weekly, twice a week. Um, and um, never actually did anything kind of online-ish. So I'm looking at um, doing that. I'm going to have a YouTube channel. Just take a little bit of that cadmium yellow. See, I've got it on my brush there. Can you see that? I don't know. Okay, so let's bring that in. And let's do a bit of a, kind of like a like serendipity little wash. Let's have some fun. Leave some white spots, okay? Uh, we never know how things are going to turn out. Of course, we just don't know. And the most important thing is you have to have fun. Let's bring that up there. I kind of don't like that. That that's kind of feels a little lost there. So yeah. See, remember you are the master of your world, so you can do whatever you want. There we go. So I just touched that up a little bit. Um, so that being said, um, I'm gonna let that dry a little tiny bit. I'm just gonna bring in some more yellows and things, and just kind of play around. I'm not too sure what I'm doing, but. If you know what you're doing, then you won't be watching this video. So there you have it. So all that being said, bring in some fresh color, move it around. It's a glorious day. And um, by the way, if anyone's wondering how to remove color, uh, you can just take a nice clean brush. Clean, clean, you hear that sound? It's a fish in the water. And that fish won't swim if the water's dirty. We can lift up color, see that? I think it's a little too heavy there. So I wanna lift up that color right there. I wanna just take some of that off. It's a little too heavy. I wanna lift that all up. You see how I've lifted that up? Clean brush, remove the water. My brush is damp. It's not dripping and I can rub. I can rub a little dots if I want circle circular motion okay something there something there just a little bit a little too heavy okay i like um there we go there we go i think that's kind of something better for me remember that we're talking about perspective things like that okay so that's interesting let's take a little bit of that color there take some from there you can always let me know what you think. Um, there you have it. So let's bring a little more rose in there. 
paper is drying a little bit, so as you can see, I've got some nice rose on my brush. Let's pop a little bit of rose in there, I don't know. Maybe something there, let's connect, not too much of a separation, okay? Yeah, that's nice, a little bit something there. Mm -hmm. A little bit there. Always leaving some white spots, all right? Let's leave a few white spots. Let's just peach that up a bit. Mix that in there, there we go, yeah. If you don't like what you've got, take your paper towel and blot it up. So there you have it. We're just kind of connecting our colors. Now, while I'm connecting those colors, I'm gonna look at taking some Alzarian Crimson. I um, hope you can see that. Here it is here, Alzarian Crimson. I'll put that right there, and you can see that. Bring in some of that nice yellow. And let's look at uh, making that little undertone a little bit more there. Sure. Don't forget, you're very able to um, soften. So what does softening mean to you? Well, right now I'm on the ground looking up, so I think whatever I see could be kind of dark to soften, clean brush, just kind of rub around the exterior edges a bit. You see how that softens all that? Makes it so nice. But what I want you to really think about is just to have a good time, okay? So I'm gonna just have some fun. I'm gonna keep painting and I'm gonna hopefully, um, there you go, you see how beautiful that is? Nice and dark. Let's bring in some more here. Yeah, that's a little bit nice. Let's, let's look at this one here. This little darling needs a little more color. She's quite underneath. So let's darken her up and soften. There we go, see, a little soften. Clean brush, just touch the edges. There we go, just like that, see that? Beautiful. Let's do that again. Let's do something down here, maybe. A little dark there, dark there. Something a dar little bit darker there. What's important, I think, uh, I'd like to convey is that you need to have contrast, okay? Contrast is important. Contrast, it's, you need to have also a variation in brush strokes, all right? So not all brush strokes will be choppy. Some brush strokes won't be choppy at all. Let's bring some of that yellow in there. Get some of that peach going, just brighten it up a bit. So I'm playing with these colors and uh, seeing how it works. There you have it. So just keep painting, keep painting, and keep trying.